Good morning, everyone. Uh, just got my Primo XL oval. Um, had for about three weeks. Uh, this is going to be my first cook. Uh, as you can see, got the Cypress table. Um, I didn't go for the teak because uh, it was just double the price, but this is just as good, especially with the cover. Uh, I did stain it teak, um, which looks exactly the same. It comes in uh, four pieces, the two side rails, uh, the shelf, and then the top. A couple of bolts. I did raise it, though. It was kind of uh, low, so I put the pressure-treated 2x4 with a 2x6 going along, and then I mounted the wheels again. But uh, now it's just about just below my waist. Um, the grill itself is about by my belly, belly button maybe. But uh, it's nice and uh, level for me. Real heavy. Great stuff. I bought all the accessories. I did cover the um, ceramic heat plates because uh, I'll be smoking today I'll be smoking some ribs I only bought one rack um, that extends the cooking surface uh, two I think is an overkill and it's hard to get underneath you know while you're cooking but uh, have all my accessories down here get my all, all my hooks hooked up my plate for my guru. It's the adapter. It's the cleaner to get the air shot. It's the uh, the grill, um, I guess, tool to remove it while it's hot. My welding gloves. I'm using lump charcoal and some wood. As you can see inside, um, I'm using regular uh, Royal Oak lump charcoal, but I did find some mesquite, mesquite um, lump charcoal, which is right here. Um, so I'm very excited to use that. Then I use my my cherry wood that gives that uh, the meat a nice mahogany color and uh, a lot of flavor and uh, red oak that my friend gave me at work um, it's gonna be a great cook my first one um, and we'll see I am uh, using a couple of uh, charcoal briquettes on my chimney over there um, they're almost ready I'm just gonna pour them on top and let the cook uh, begin Just added the briquettes on top of everything. And uh, I'm gonna get it to temperature. I'm gonna cook about 225 today, nice and slow. Um, but um, I will, I will try a few different things today. That's it. Let me put the uh, racks in before I close it. All the racks are in. Put the tray. I put some apple juice and some um, apple cider vinegar. And I'm just going to bring it up to temp. I think I might go to 300 degrees. 300 degrees. Open this all the way. And a vent underneath to open all the way. Before I even set my guru up, I'm just gonna bring it up to about 3, 350, get it nice and hot, and then uh, shut everything down and set up my uh, my guru. My chickens are dying to come out. It's not time yet, but they are screaming. Probably hit them. That's another story, but I'll put up a part two. Once I get the ribs on and uh, 
and uh, when they're ready. Excited today, my first cook. The reason why I waited so long is I got the grill, went on a vacation for a week, came back, I had to put the table together, had to stain it, um, I gave it about two or three coats, and uh, the cover is really nice. Comes with this little uh, dome for the uh, for the daisy wheel on top. So very nice. I'm excited. And now that's it. Wow! Look at the temperature. It went from 200 to 400 already. Unbelievable. All right. I'll uh, I'll see you uh, later. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, reverse smoker at gmail.com. Thanks.